Hi everybody, this is Gabriel Shaheen, Certified Financial Planner and President of Falcon Wealth Planning. Today I want to talk to you about home capital gain exclusion, which means if you lived in the home two out of the past five years, you could sell your home and not pay up to $250,000 of capital gains that you made on the property. If you're married, you could double that. It's $500,000. So this example, you have a home that's $750,000. You bought it for $200,000, which means you made $550,000 on the home. Now, the way it works is if your cost basis is $200,000, let's say you did $100,000 of remodel for what we'll call capital improvements, okay? You could be doing the floors, we're doing kitchens, bathrooms, you name it. By doing that, that gets added to your cost basis. So really your cost basis is $300,000. The reason that's important is if you have $750,000, that means you made $450,000 of profits. You get to subtract out the improvements you make to the home. It doesn't matter what your mortgage is, whether you owe zero or $750,000. It doesn't matter what the mortgage is. This is what you pay based on the cost basis. In addition, you're able to write off any closing costs or commissions. Let's say 6% plus one uh, commissions, 1% closing costs. That's $50,000. You also get to write off your closing costs and commissions. And so really it's $400,000. So if you're single, you only have to pay capital gains of $150,000 because they give you a free $250,000 off. If you're married, you can sell the property and not pay any taxes at all. Folks, if you have any questions on this, please reach out. We'd be happy to help. Information's down below.